right there. We have a litter of three and a half week old lichen shepherds. Outside for the very first time, we just set them on the ground. You'll notice one here has a patch of shorter hair on his back. He got a little bit of tree sap on his back when uh, mom got some on her leg and rather than wash it out, I just cut about a half inch of hair off his back. See, they're uh, doing pretty good. I'm uh, very impressed. Again, it shows you uh, some of the benefits of that early uh, neurological stimulation. You know, this is a new environment for these puppies. They've never been outside. We've got a busy street behind us with traffic noises. And uh, we don't have a bunch of puppies hugging the ground. We've got them out exploring around, sniffing. And I'm uh, very, very happy. Amy, can you go by the gate? <laughs> this little guy here is Puko. This is uh, that puppy that I saved uh, in that birthing video. The one that was choking. He's uh, going to be one of my keepers. Right here, this little nugget is uh, the little girl from the litter. Isn't she a cutie? <laughs> but again, uh, this is showing you their very first time outside experiencing all the new sights and smells. Gives you a little window into their personalities. Again, I'm very happy with what I see. Getting them used to the clicking noise that I use to communicate with my dogs. You can see they're already starting to respond to it a little bit. Got a little crowd of them around me here now. I was rushing Kurgan and Lobo out here. A little bit of hair in the grass there.
guy cute. Come here for a second, Tammy. Show you with some of uh, all that handling and the neurological testing. You can see you can. The puppies are pretty tolerant to stuff now. You can do pretty much what you want with them, and they'll uh, they'll put up with it. And it shows some of the benefits of that. And they don't get easily stressed by stuff. Again, these are just three and a half week old puppies here. They look a lot older because of their size, but. That's all they are. And you can see all of them. They're pretty compliant. I can uh, move them around. They don't get all bent out of shape. You don't see them squirming, getting all riled or upset. I mean, again, that shows some of the benefits of some of those exercises that you show me doing. And if you look uh, down at my channel, I've got a couple of videos on that. I'll link one at the end of the video. Again, it creates puppies that are just... Uh, a lot more able to use to deal with stress and adapt to new things again these guys have never been outside you know you hear a little bit of griping here and there but you, you don't see them hugging the ground you see them exploring sniffing around and that again shows some of the benefits of that super dog program and again i can do this with all of them again they're all really relaxed that's what you like to see they don't get easily rattled thank you Tammy so again I just wanted to show you a little bit of that again this is their very first time outside and you can see they're handling it well And you can see I'm getting them so they all respond to those clicks now. And uh, that will transfer later on to a lot of the off-leash work I'm going to do with them. Again, I start all that stuff young. I have plenty of videos on that if you want to see how I train puppies off-leash. I typically start with them about nine weeks old. Like, subscribe, and share. Uh, hit that notification bell down below if you like these videos a lot. You'll get email notifications when my new videos come out. I really like this little dude. He's the smallest one in the litter. Not a runt at all, but uh, he's a cutie. I like him. He's got a neat personality. And I had to cut some tree sap out of the fur of this guy here. He just cut like the first half layer off. I didn't want to use any harsh soaps or cleaners on him. The puppy skin is uh, so sensitive, uh, I just thought it was just easier to clip it with the scissors. Little man. Let's see, they're, uh, they're pretty cute. Come on. Boys. Come on. <laughs> Little honker. Here, it's supposed to be a, a dog, not a geese, not a goose. Again, I hope you enjoyed these videos. This was the puppy's 
very first time outside. Gives you a little bit of a window into their personalities and uh, how they're coming along temperament wise. And I'm really happy with what I see. I don't see any puppies hugging the ground. They're all confidently uh, sniffing things. You know, if you see a dog sniffing something, that means its brain's working. When dogs are scared, they don't smell stuff around them. Bye from the beautiful Tammy. Bye. And myself. And of course, the fabulous seven. See ya.